How to fix update KV5050094 failed to install in Windows 11 24 H2. Hello friends, follow the steps. Install the update from Microsoft Update Catalog. Go to the link to Microsoft Update Catalog from the video description. You will reach this page. Here are two files, one for x64 based systems and the second ARM64 based systems. Check your system type, click on start, click on settings, go to system, scroll down, click on about, here is system type, system type of my computer is 64 bit operating system. Check on your computer and download the file from here. Click on download. Click on both the links one by one. Once downloaded, click on the file explorer icon. Click on downloads. Right click on the MSE file KV5050094. Click on open. Click on yes on the pop up. The update will be installed after two or three reboots. After installing this update, right click on this file and select open and install this update. If the issue still persists, modify services. Click on search, type services, press enter. On the services window, go to windows update. This one, right click on this service, select properties, Make sure that uh, startup type is automatic on your system. If it is not, click on this drop down and select automatic. Click on a start. If a start button is grayed out on your system, leave it as it is. Click on apply and click on OK. Now right click on Windows update. Select restart. Then look for background intelligent transfer service. This service, right click on uh, this service. Click on properties. This is also known as bits. Change the startup type to automatic. And click on a start if it is highlighted. Otherwise leave it as it is. Click on apply, click on OK. Right click on background intelligent transfer service, select restart. Now go to the cryptographic services. This one, right click on this service, select properties, change the startup type to automatic if it is not set on your computer, and click on a start if the service status is just stop. Otherwise leave it and click on apply, click on OK. Right click on cryptographic services, select restart. Close the services window. Go to start, settings and windows update. Click on check for updates. In case the issue is not fixed till now, then reset Windows update components. Click on search, type CMD. Right click on command prompt. Select run as administrator. Click on yes on the USC pop-up. Go to the description of this video. You will find these commands in the description. Copy the first line. Paste into the command prompt. Hit enter. 
copy the second line paste into the command prompt hit enter copy the third line paste into the command prompt press enter in this way run all these commands and at last restart your computer remember to close the running tasks and files before restarting your computer then click on start click on the power icon and click on restart now go to windows update then click on check for updates If you want to reset Windows Update components using downloadable file, then go to the description of this video. Click on the given link. This will download a zip file. Click on the folder icon. Select Extract All. Click on Extract. Right click on W underscore reset 2.0 dot BAT. Press any key to continue. Press any key to continue. Again, press a key. Close all the windows and files and then restart your computer. Then try to install the update. If the issue is still occurring, then run system files checker and DISM tools. Click on search. Type CMD, select Run as Administrator, click on Yes, go to the description of this video, copy the SFC scan now command, paste into the command prompt, press Enter, wait for a while until it is 100% completed. Now run the DISM commands, copy the first command, paste into the command prompt and hit enter. Copy the second command, paste into the command prompt, press enter. Copy the third line of command for restore health, paste into the command prompt, press enter. Once done, close the command prompt, close the other running task and restart your computer. Then go to Windows Update Settings. And click on Check for Updates. If any update is found, let it download and at last restart your PC. Check Disk Space. Click on the File Explorer icon from the taskbar. Go to this PC. Find the drive where the Windows is installed and make sure that enough space is available in the drive to accommodate the update. If free space is not available, you can run disk cleanup to delete unnecessary files. To run disk cleanup, click on search, type clean MGR, press enter, choose a correct drive where the windows is installed and click on OK. Click on cleanup system files here. Again click on OK. Make sure that all the boxes are checked in this section. Click on OK. Click on delete files. 
you can also uninstall uh, less important applications right click on start button select install types find the less important software installed on your computer click on three dots and select uninstall after enough space is available try to install the update perform in place upgrade open a browser type windows 11 download press enter click on this link download windows 11 go down click on this drop down select windows 11 multi edition iso for x64 devices click on download now select the product language check the product language on your computer click on start select settings go to time and language click on language and region windows display languages english united states close the settings app and here choose english united states click on confirm click on 64 bit download once downloading is completed go to file explorer click on downloads right click on the downloaded iso file select mount click on open in the mounted drive right click on setup.exe select open click on yes Uninstall Windows 11 window, click on next. Checking for updates. On applicable notices and license terms, click on accept. Then follow the on screen instructions to complete the installation. That's all, friends. Thanks for watching the video.